Hello everyone, today's topic is how to edit your web page. In a previous lesson we learned how to edit a home page. Let's pick one unit, a web page that we would like to edit. I would go pick internet and computer safety. Anytime you want to edit a page, you would click on the button that looks like a pen or pencil. That's edit page. You would click on it and your page would be in edit mode. Like I explained before, you could use layout, you could use two column. If you like, you could use three column if you like, or you could stay with standard single column. You could pick a font of your choice. You could pick the font size of your choice. You could bold your text, italicize, underline, change the color of your font, add a background color to your font, you could hyperlink it, you could create a list using numbers or bullets. You can indent your paragraphs, you could align your paragraphs to left, center, right. So let's start with editing internet and computer safety unit. For each page that you need to edit, you would need to write two things. First, what I learned I have my paragraph ready for what I learned in Internet and Computer Safety Unit. I'm going to copy and paste my information in here. I would right click and fix any spelling mistakes that I have. Okay, now this is my title. So I'm going to select my title and I can make it bold. I can change the color of my title. So here's my paragraph about what I learned in my Internet and Computer Safety Unit. I'm going to select my text and if I want I can change the font size. This looks too small. I can make it big. If I like I can change my font to normal or I could change to Georgia. Make sure that you stay consistent with the font throughout your website. Don't pick different font for every page. Stay consistent, it looks more professional. The next information that I need to put on my page is going to be what software I used. Again, this is going to be my title. I'm going to select it and I'm going to select my font, Georgia. And I'm going to select the title and my titles. I'm going to make it consistent with the same color, green. I used Comic Life. I used Microsoft Word. Again, if you have spelling mistakes, you got to fix it. I used Google Chrome. I went to some websites like BrainPop, NetSmarts, and I used Google Chrome to go to those websites. Again, if you don't like this format, you can always go to Edit Page and you could go to Layout. And since we have two information, I could select two columns in here. So I can put my software used in here and I can put what I learned in here. So this is my two column layout. I have what I learned in one column and what softwares I used in another column. If you don't like this, you can always keep your standard layout. That is one column. Now you'll do the same thing for computer history. You can copy and paste your titles Let's go to computer history, edit the page by clicking on edit, paste your title, what I learned, put another title, what software I used. So for every web page you would put in two things, what I learned, what software I used. Make sure they're all same font, titles, bold, click save. Actually I'm going to copy this. Let's click save. 
I'm going to go to computers today I'm going to click on edit page and I'm going to paste my titles in here what I learned software used and click Save go to how computers work unit I'm going to edit my page by clicking on this button edit page I'm going to paste my titles and I'm going to click Save the internet computer safety we did this already let's click on introduction unit I would click on edit button I would paste my titles what I learned what software I used and I would click Save so when all my pages have those two titles and for every page I'm going to write down what I learned and what software I used in my next video I'll show you how to add files to showcase your work